Hey, what's up YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, and it's time for another review. It's review time, people. And this is Eddie Hill Review. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe before we get on to this video, because it's very important. And today, we got ourselves a real treat from Transformers. And yes, it is Transformers Week, and we got Power Core Combiners. Huffer. And this is just a baggie from eBay <laughs> with the instructions in the baggie and some product shot of Huffer if you want to look at it. He does not come with the whole Weapon Master he had in this line because this is an incomplete one. Missing that. But he's in a cool truck mode. And I don't mind if he's missing his main weapon accessory. He's awesome. I love it. He rolls. Very well. And this is kind of like a movie design version. Of Huffer. Look at that paint. Look at that sculpting. I love it. The moment I got this in hand and filled it around with it a lot, I fell in love with it. Sorry if I have to correct myself. My mind was getting a little bit confused. Sorry about that YouTube land. My autism has decided to kick in this week. <laughs> and my brain went screwy. But that's all there is to say for truck mode. Let's get down to transformation. We're going to split the back section of the truck, fold these up, and we're going to show off combined mode first. As soon as I can set them up. There we got the combined mode legs ready to go, almost. If I can get them to plug in. And yes, he is a combiner torso. Power Core Combiners did that. And given, since I'm reviewing an old Huffer figure, makes sense to show that off first. So I can flip out these blue tabs, but there we have Combine Mode. We don't have any drones to plug into him, I'm afraid. If I get a bomb shot from Power Core Combiners, I'll show that off. But for now, he doesn't have that. So let's get him back to robot mode. Flip in the hands. Fold back up the combined mode head. And it folds up pretty nicely. Sorry if I had to correct. I had to get confused there. My autism is really flaring up today. It hasn't flared up in a while. But today it is. Now I'm trying to make the arm go down. And here we got Huffer in his robot mode. And he looks really good. Really good paint sculpt on that head. I love it. And the chest is really well molded. So are the arms, the legs. I love this figure. And this is a throwback review. So here he is next to my other Huffer figure from Transformers Beast Hunters Huffer. And that's what he looks like next to it in truck mode, pickup truck mode. But now we're going to compare it in robot mode. Because this is my first Huffer. And this one's my second to this date. So, yeah. And here we got Huffer almost transformed. And here he is next to Beast Hunters Huffer. Yeah, they share some similar head sculpt similarities, but they're different sculpts. I like this version better than than the Beast Hunters one. But they're both pretty cool. 
by my standards, you're probably wondering, where did I get this? I got this from eBay for about $10. You could probably find it on eBay for that much, even if it doesn't have the whole Weapon Master thing included with it. Plus, it's much cheaper to pick up the figure. And I got another gun I give him. Since he doesn't have the Weapon Master that he can hold in his hand with some force. <laughs> Sorry about that. And a part of his hand just... <laughs> Part of his little robot hand just decided to do some popping loose of extra bits. But I can totally get him holding this gun. With, I guess he's not going to hold the gun, huh? <laughs> but I got another solution for a gun. Give me a second to... I got the perfect weapon for him. And he can hold this right on his side. And then he can pull out this gun and be like, Hey Decepticons, eat double blaster. And this is from a connect to bots and these work well with figures. Now he's ready for battle. Ready to blast some Decepticons. That's all there is to say for this video. Eddie Hill, moving on. And rock on and rock out. YouTube land.